The reason you should come see Guys on Ice is because, A, you'll have a terrific time because it celebrates um, very individual people, two lifelong friends who uh, go out for a day on the ice and they help one another through some relationship issues, which is um, kind of poignant. It's just an enjoyable uh, time to spend with these two guys. Guys on Ice started in, in Door County in 1998 and really the, the the seed of it was uh, Fred Alley, who's the book writer and lyricist for the piece. The music and the lyrics of Guys on Ice, I think, are a huge part of their success. I think Fred Alley and and uh, you know the testament to him was having won the Richard Rogers Award for Spitfire Grill. You know that's an award that at that time Stephen Sondheim was was integrally involved in. He got wind of a, a granting opportunity through the state of Wisconsin because of the sesquicentennial celebration, 150 year anniversary, and he thought, well, we could do something dry and boring and uninteresting, and it would only last for as long as this celebration lasts. But why don't we think outside the box here and think about what it means to be a Wisconsinite 150 years in. We honor and we respect the the realness of these characters and, and who they are um, in their culture of ice fishing and Northern Wisconsin. Whatever happened between Steve and Doug uh, cemented not only the, the relationship in Guys on Ice for Lloyd and for Marvin, but I think it cemented a real friendship for Doug and Steve. And I think the beauty for me in watching them do this now thousands of times together is they've grown into these roles as they've grown into their friendship. I often say about the two of them, and they don't mind my saying this, that they're they're really like an old married couple. They're very funny together when they're not on stage. It, it really is reflective of everything that they do in the piece together. When you get that kind of chemistry that happens on stage, then you have cracked I bet I'd say 75% of the nut. I think the reason that it resonates so strongly with people is because they see themselves in who these guys are. They see themselves in who these guys relate to. And, and plus, it's funny. It's extremely funny. And I think that's why people love it so much is because they laugh. And who doesn't love to laugh?